It's Disney World week! Oh boy, in two days. In two days. So next week is our trip. We're super excited. So our focus is packing, getting organized, and our second goal of the week is we're trying to coordinate a treatment for Jack in Florida, which has been a little bit complicated. Try to track down someone to talk to to try to get that scheduled. Um, they haven't been the most responsive, so we need to try to figure out if Jack can get a treatment next week while we're in Florida. They said it's just not ideal to skip a week, so we're gonna try to accommodate our trip. Disney, yeah, Disney, yeah. Are you ready to embrace the storm? Oh. Ready? Let's go! <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> Did you get super wet? No. No? Almost. Luckily, as we are doing this AFO journey and these night splints as we wait, she was able to find some generic AFOs for Mason to take on the trip to kind of help his stability and balance and um, they fit great. So we already, so we have a temporary AFO for him until we can get the fitted ones. Hopefully that works. He hasn't really gotten used to them yet, but I'm really excited to get him some AFOs, um, even if they're generic sizing just to see how much it helps. So um, walking all day at Disney World will be a good indicator if those work or not. We're gonna go ahead and try to coordinate Jack to get his ex on skipping while we're in Florida, which has been a little bit complicated um, figuring out. There's a lot of hands in the pot. There's a lot of pharmacy, the infusion care, Sarepta, um, trying to coordinate someone coming to the hotel to infuse Jack. Apparently a Florida doctor would have to sign off on it and then they would have to find a qualified nurse in Orlando. So I'm gonna have to make some phone calls and do the whole process. If you know, you know. So um, I'm going to start that today. Uh, that you needed coverage. We were under the impression for two weeks that's next week and the week after but your home infusion the nurse that was seeing your son prior to you going on vacation she's no longer available and the agency said that they reached out and told you this nope they did, did not. anybody call you nope <laughs> All right, so I just organized everything I plan to put in our park bag. So our, I'm gonna just have it all packed so we can just grab and go and everything should be in there. So I'm gonna try to stuff all of this in one bag. Um, hats, rain jackets. These are for the room, but they're like sore, achy foot mask, Epsom salt mask for your foot. If we get really sore, stroller poncho, stroller fan, kind of a mom bag here with lip balm, chapstick, setting powder, because it's so humid, the boys chapstick, hair tie, hair clip, a setting spray and a comb, and then I have a little rubber band hair ties. This one's like liquid IVs, gum, eye drops, Tums, hand sanitizer. So the, our little tech pouch, which is gonna have our portable chargers, cord chargers, watch charger, earplugs. I thought I would bring a pair of earplugs just in case things get too loud for Mason. Sometimes he can be sensitive to really loud noises. So I thought that was a good idea. We also have noise canceling headphones that I might bring as well, if he prefers that instead of those in his ear. Sunglasses, 
Um, I need to get Mason's sunglasses and then my sunglass case that has two pair in there. First aid, so some blister band-aids. Um, there's band-aids for the boys in there. Body Glide, if you know, you know. Ibuprofen, Mortums, Desitin. Again, if you know, you know. Um, our gift cards, so this entire year I knew we were gonna go to Orlando, so for gifts, uh, for birthdays and Christmas and stuff, we were asking for Disney gift cards so that it wouldn't be a be helpful towards our expenses and they can kinda choose what they want at the parks, which will be really nice. And then I also did, I also got these little wristbands to put on them that have our phone number and their name in case they run off. You never know. Antibacterial wipes, sunscreen for the boys, sunscreen, sunscreen balm, and then I brought tinted sunscreen for myself. We're gonna have our little mini fans, diapers, and a changing pad for Mr. Jack, and our hydro flasks. So I'm gonna try to fit all of this in a diaper bag, so wish me luck, but I thought these little pouches would be kind of an easy filing system and we can see what's in there and not have to dig out 50 items to find the one thing you swore you put in that one pocket and then your whole bag is destroyed, which is my problem. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and see if we can organize this lovely in the diaper bag and my plan was to be able to just wake up, get dressed, feed the kids, grab and go. Cause usually I'm uh, scrambling in the morning trying to figure out what to throw in the bag and it's not organized and I'm trying to be a lot more organized this time. And we're allowing the boys to stay up a little late to watch a Disney movie. Oh, yeah. Guess what they chose? Inside Out. Cause Mason just saw Inside Out 2. I was gonna say Big Hero 6. Yeah, Inside Out 2 was an incredible movie I recommend. Oh. If anyone has struggled with anxiety in their life, go watch that movie and it explains it. Chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. <laughs> now Brian comes in. He's the Tetris man. We did it. I'm actually shocked that we got it all in there. <laughs> Double day. Travel day, yay! yay. You excited? Mm -hmm. We're ready to go. We're here. We're here. <laughs> Listen, how was your first flight? Cool. Where we're headed right now? This is done. Nope. Yep. You guys, my hair has met the Florida humidity, but we made it. <laughs>